Nice not fish, e Shane. Not exactly the target fish we're after today, but <laughs> you know what? That's a good fish. When you got way. buy cash like that, you'll take it. <laughs> Yeah, that's it. Like, move video, buddy. Fast forward and the whole thing virtually again. Yeah, that is another flat dog. They're liking this big prawn. Yeah. yeah. Watch him, eh? Yeah, not a bad flat dog too. Oh. Yep. Oh, not a bad flat dog. Oh, I don't know this. This outfit makes even a 60 feel like a heavy fish. Yeah, good fun though, that's what we use them like. Yeah. Just have the sport out of them. Yep. But she's sitting down. Yeah. Yep. I can feel it tinging over her teeth every time she oh, no. she turns. I can just feel that like every time she swings around the other way, you can hear that you feel a ting as it runs over her front teeth. Oop, there we go again. Another ting. And she changes direction. Look, she's not going to be huge, but on this light gear, six pound leader. Don't forget, this is <laughs> this is four pound braid, six pound leader. Yeah, it's um. You can grab that GoPro if you wanted to, Matt. Just clip it off, put it on the handle that's sitting on that bait tray. And then on the side of it, just hold that button down until it goes bip bip. So you see a little power button on the side? It'll be on the... Yep, and then press the top button. Yep, done. You're up. All right, so just to repeat, yeah, that's not a bad fish. What are you using? Are you using room gear? Yeah. I could probably need it, mate, if you want to hand me the net. I'll just, all right, okay. All right, mate, thank you. Yeah, she's not a bad fish. So I was only just saying to Matt, we just picked up on a little one there. Um, just these rocks out in the middle here. Like, just another perfect little ambush point for you know, the flathead to sit around these rocks. Beautiful colours on her. But just gotta take it easy.
Nah, she's not done. Watch that light later, yeah. Hang on, Chuck. I don't think she's ready, mate. Not a bad winter flatfish. You're all right, it's all right. Okay, this is the one. Yep, beautiful, mate. Well done. Nice. Thank you. Time, yep, on. yep, on that like here. Not, ex fish, not exactly the target fish we're after today, but <laughs> you know what? It's a good fish. When you got like. buy cash like that, you'll take it. <laughs> yeah, she's not a bad fish. What do you reckon? Nudge and 70? Yeah, she'd have to be nudge and 70. Yeah, beautiful. Just to give you an idea on how much of that lure was down her throat. Oh. Yeah, well, we'd have to say her. It's a six pound litre. There we go. Bang, done. So that's it. That's the line popped. So that's why we had to play it so soft with her. It's beautiful dark colours on her only simply because she's hanging around the rocks at the moment. So, you know, Matt will just chuck her on the uh, on the lie detector for me. And we'll get that lure out of her. Close, but not quite 70. Ah, still nice though, beautiful fish. She hasn't been out for very long, so we're just pretty much a spear in. She's not that big, but she'll be fine. There she goes. Straight to the bottom. Easy as that. So 66 centimetres. Chase some brim. Um, we end up six pound line, sorry, six four pound braid and six pound litre and yeah lucky I played it so soft awesome. and we just have a look at the location here as we can see we've just got this this rock wall or well, rock island which is um, exposed at low tide so yeah and they're just sitting on the edge here we were chasing after brim but you know what I'll take a nice flathead like that any day all right so finished up today um, what was the grand total mate Trying to think. <laughs> um, well, I don't know the exact numbers. What yeah. was it? We got a few brim. The brim weren't weren't firing. Yeah. But we got a few flathead, and, and the brim we did catch were good size. So. Yeah. It's the the fish that were caught were really some really nice um, brim that were caught um, around that 40 centimetre mark. Um, a beautiful, nice 66 or 65 centimetre flathead, and then a couple of a couple of nice models in the 50s as well. So. Um, look, I'd say that, you know, today in particular the brim weren't firing, even though that was the target species, but definitely had plenty of fun, definitely yeah, got yeah. the, uh, so the rods still bent. Got plenty of fish, a, a lot of tailor. <laughs> yeah, a lot of tailor in the system at the moment, so, um, yeah, so really using brim gear, um, but really got hold of quite a few nice flathead today, so, yeah, thank you if you made it all the way through to, to this part of the video, I really appreciate it. Um, don't forget to smash that like button, um, subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, really appreciate your support and um, I'd like to thank Matty again for uh, coming out with me today. It's nothing better than going out in the water and having a good, good day on the water with the best mate. So, um, like I said, if you can't port Stevens, obviously, hopefully, you can use some of these areas and techniques to hopefully get on all the fish yourself and you can enjoy the waterway like we do. Alright, so fish responsibly and um, thanks, Matt. Appreciate the day. Yeah, it was good fun. Alright, see you next time.